just folding my laundry and Leo is never <laughs> too far away. Look at his paws right here. You ready to start our day? Okay. Come on. Come on, maybe we get out of bed now. So every morning, Leo just stands guard while I'm in the bathroom. I heard that cats and dogs do this because they are trying to protect you. Usually in the wild, when you're going to the bathroom as an animal, you're vulnerable, so they protect you. So I really appreciate that he's protecting me. <laughs> okay, let's go get some breakfast. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Did you already eat your breakfast? You already ate your breakfast, didn't you? <laughs> so cute. He always begs like he's starving, but he already ate his breakfast. He woke up before I did. He always wakes up pretty early. Where are your treats? You know where your treats are? In here? Are they in here? Okay. His treats. This is just our pantry. I just have his treats in here. That's it. Good boy. taking his little afternoon nap while I'm working, while he's waiting for me. He's such a good boy. <laughs> How cute. Oh, he's tired. Hi. Maybe we'll go for a little walk. Look, I said walk. And his little tail. He's just like a dog, his little tail. Come on, Leo. You ready? Let's go. Let's go. Good boy. Go and take a walk. We're going to take a walk. Okay, let's go. Ready? Okay, let's go. Leo was so excited to go on his walk today. He hasn't been on a walk in a couple of weeks just because I have been really busy. I've been going on like trips and stuff back and forth. So he was super excited. He was smelling everything. He was so interested in all the leaves. He was taking a very, very long walk and was super energetic. Look at that cute little fluffy booty. How adorable. He is just so awesome when it comes to walks. Um, I did have to train him a couple of times. I wanted to train him to stay on the sidewalks. Um, when I first was walking him, he really just immediately wanted to go into the grass. And because he is an indoor cat, I didn't want him doing that just because I didn't want him coming home with a bunch of dirt on him or a bunch of bugs on him. So we just walk on the sidewalk. And what I do to train him if he deters from the sidewalk, like you can see right now, he does that sometimes. I just give him a little bit of a tug and just kind of lead him gently back to the sidewalk. And you'll kind of see him struggle a little bit. He wants to go the other direction, but he comes back eventually. And now he's plopping down because he has a cat and he just plops down sometimes and he is deciding on what to do and what do you want to do Leo so he decides he wants to go back in the wrong direction but I am 
going to guide him right back and you'll see him come back. Um, the leash is really, really important when you are walking a cat or you have a cat outside. I had a leash that didn't fit him and wasn't comfortable on him when I first started walking him and training him to walk was impossible. And after I changed his leash to a comfortable one, he was able to pick up um, walking so easily. He was so easy to train. He, like Siberian cats are honestly like just so smart. Um, so we are heading back home right now. He knows his way home and this is actually our driveway and he is just going to plop down. You'll see him and we're gonna chill here until it's time to go back inside. Well, let's get your leash off. Good boy, you did such a good job today. I always give him a quick brush after the walk just to get leaves and dirt off of his fur. As far as what I feed him, I feed him dry food every single day. He gets fed twice a day and about once or twice a week I do feed him wet food and he absolutely looks forward to his wet food. It's kind of like a extra treat for him. Yummies, you're all done. Yeah. So I'm just folding my laundry and Leo is never <laughs> too far away. Look at his paws right here. <laughs> he just likes to be nearby. Where are you? Where are your face? There you are. Are you going to sleep in here, Leo? Oh my goodness, he's so cute. And I don't even care that he's in my laundry basket. I don't even care. I love you. You gonna take a nap in there? I'll see you later? Okay, I love you. I'll see you later. I am actually working right now. I'm getting a little bit of work done before bed. And a lot of the times, guys, I, Leo just loves to sit on my lap and he puts his feet, like he pushes his feet up against the table sometimes. And honestly, he can sit here for hours if I hold him. This is his favorite. <laughs> he is so cute. I am just getting some work done before we head to bed and as you can see Leo absolutely loves being held and snuggled. He will sit there all day if I let him and I totally will because he is such a good cat. I love him. Time to go to bed. He gets his snuggles. He lays like on my belly. Make sure he gets all his love. All the love and attention he deserves because he's such a good kitty. This is my view. <laughs> <laughs> 